Meadows End is the village we all come from, right? Because you will know people in this place. You will notice the amateur boxer. You will notice the lad that sat on the side of the road selling bottles of something you have no business to know. All that sort. You'll find life at the, literally, the grassroots. All like that. So we take you through. If we're going to have grassroots, let's have roads through them. Here we have Meadows End. The automotive empire of Neville Edward Willis. Remember that, N-E-W. New World Auto Sales. My stars! They've got some beautiful cars in here. And this is where he does the strip tease. The Jaguar is covered over with a green tarpaulin. The other two clapped out bangs at the side are the props. And he will explain this lousy car, that lousy car, and slowly but surely walk past and expose a headlight. This is called the strip tease. By the time you're fed up and listening to the other two cars, he whips off the tarpaulin and you've got a Jaguar there. They're foaming at the mouth to buy it. That's the theory. He sells this Jaguar three times in one week. All to be collected on Saturday morning at nine o'clock. When they get in there, they will find it empty. All they can see is the railway timetable with trains to London and the 831 underline. Of course, he's not on the uh, train to London. He's on the 8 o'clock bus to Heckman Wyke where he will start up his next empire, which starts with N-E-W, Neville Edward Willis. So off we go here. Can you see we're going in a Z-like pattern and we go to the boxing. Little Joe Sharkey, bit of a lad, all that sort of business. And there's some betting going off around him. Here we have Bonnie Bet. She is the bookie's friend, in inverted commas. And they are running away with the money because they expect little Joe Sharkey to win. Regrettably, he doesn't. So there is trouble brewing there, which is why they're on the way here. Here, you can see him again by the yellow waistcoat, Neville Edward Willis. He's selling Zampa. Zampa is the miracle cure. Don't give it to your kids, by the way, or anything like that. But it's made up with Vonnie Betts in the backyard of their latest temporary house. Here he is. It's wonderful. He's out there. There is a shape looming over him in a camel coat with a velvet collar. That's the bookie that he owes the money to from one of his enterprises deep down inside the bowels of the painting. So the thing is, it's an S shape, goes up, and at the top, here we have when everything catches up with Neville Edward Willis. So in point of fact, it is a celebration of the downfall of this man.